Good morning. It's a good place to start a week, isn't it? Though technically we're leaving here. Because it's Saturday and it's rainy and it's time to go home. Welcome to another episode of Trophy Stupid Vlog. We are in Bern at the Bern Market. So that's the Swiss Federal Parliament, that's their National Bank, it's the capital cities as well, important stuff happens, like, you know, parliamenting and banking. And that down there is the cathedral, which is downhill towards the Bears. This is Old Bairn. Stretching round. But well, the most exciting bit is back this way. It's over there. That is a bear park. Now I can see the head of one bear. This is rolling around in that log over there. We'll go a bit closer. There you go, there's a bear. There he is. It's a delicious apple. Oh yeah. Nice. He's munching an apple there, just up the road. That's Ben Munster. It's cathedral for all you non-German speakers. And uh, this is the uh, Munster Park, which is where we just had some lunch. Now we're gonna wander back to the station. And head back to the United Kingdom of Sun, as it should be next week. <laughs> No, exactly. It's left here, so we, we're going wherever the sun is. That's how fickle we are. Get on the train and go over that bridge. Oh joy, it is ten to five, which means I'm back. In fact, um, we've just seen all the preparations for the Olympic arrivals and what have you. And we even saw two members of the Mongolian Olympic team. Not quite a Mongolian horde, I grant you, but you know, that's a good, it's a good start. Now we're waiting for our bags, which are much slower than we are. So this is what coming back from holiday does. We're actually up and out at 20 past 11. Ever so efficient. <laughs> I just spent morning putting things away and, and packing and sorting things out, laundry and recycling and all sorts of boring stuff. And we have no food. So that's what we're going to do now is buy some. Kevin, do you fancy a guess? Really? Okay, listen very carefully. £60,000, Kevin. Who are they? <laughs> Tina Turner, you say? Saying the word whose? Jolie Richardson saying the word hearts, and you reckon Al Gore is saying the word on for £60,000. Your heart's going. My heart's going too, because that's a huge amount of money, 60 grand. It is life changing. Kevin, Al Gore. I tell you what, I just want to play you something. 
Hello, Kevin. Hello, Kevin. Um, we pre-recorded that first bit, and we're going to come back immediately after the news, and uh, Nick will do the reveal. Okay, so I'm going to keep you on hold for a couple of minutes. Then you're going to hear yourself. You'll hear that conversation you just had with Nick, and then um, Nick will play something to you, and we'll reveal how many you got right. Okay. Uh, best of luck, Kevin. I'm going to pop you on hold for a moment, and um, just keep quiet until you um, until you hear uh, the audio Nick's going to play you. Okay. Um, be back with you in just a moment. That was easy. Are you aged 18 to 40? You got it the first time. Yep. Going? Hello. Al Gore, I'll tell you what. I want to play you something. Yeah. Okay. Listen. Okay. I might say, okay. Yes, my foot. Dig us on part. So our massive jackpot of £60,000 is still waiting to be won. We have our three secret celebrities. Tina Turner is saying the word who's. Joni Richardson is saying the word heart. It's the man saying the word on. And there's that hint on the website, on the homepage at heart.co.uk. 60 grand the jackpot. Let's go to the lines. Kevin. Hello there. Do you fancy a guess? Yes. Okay. Listen very carefully. Who's on heart? £60,000, Kevin. Who are they? Right. Uh, Tina Turner, Al Gore and Jolie Richardson. Tina Turner, you say? Yeah. Saying the word who's? Yeah. Jolie Richardson saying the word heart and you reckon Al Gore is saying the word yeah. on for £60,000. My heart's going. Your heart's going? <laughs> My heart's going too because that's a huge amount of money, 60 grand. It is life-changing. Kevin. Hello. Al Gore. I tell you what, I just want to play you something. Who's Tina Turner? I don't like to bring in new personalities. I like to know who's there. On Al Gore. We put those on television. Hard. Jolie Richardson. Her best role was as a monarch and that perhaps that was her true heart. Kevin, you've just won sixty thousand oh pounds. Yeah. 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 Can you believe it? I can't believe it. Tina Turner is saying who's, Al Gore is saying on, oh. and Jolie yeah. Richardson is saying the word heart. You have done it. Yeah, my first time on it. £60,000 oh, is a I huge, life-changing yeah. amount of money. Oh, my God. You are going to have the best summer ever, Kevin. Oh, my God. How are, gonna spend, how are you going to spend that money? Got any ideas what you're going to spend it on? Well, I think we've all to be packing up work and we'll be trying for another baby. That is perfect. Yeah. You, and, and book yourself a holiday. Got to go away for a few days That's as well. Perfect. Let it sink in. Kevin, congratulations. Wow. You've just wow. won £60,000 on wow. Who's on Heart. Who's on Heart. Kevin, I don't know what's going on, boys. Congratulations. Well done. There were so many buttons. <laughs> well done, mate. Well done. Yeah. I bet. You, there's a lot of people in the studio who are rather excited as well, but I mean, that is fantastic. Many, many congratulations. Uh, Kevin, I think the important thing now is you take some contact details for me so we can write you a very, very large check. How'd you feel, Nick, Steve? That, that was complicated. I'm. So, <laughs> so I have Kevin. Kev's won the cash. Uh, Kevin, what's the best contact number for you? <laughs> Huh? Well, so congratulations yeah. again, Kevin. Um, that, it's been a long time coming, but we're very happy that you won the money. Well, that was... And he went mad, so it was great. He was good. He got some people with him, so it's good. Yeah. It's paid off, hasn't it? It's paid off. Yeah. Three times. Brilliant. Outdoor dinner for the first time in, well, I think I managed it twice with Adam, so that's well over a year ago. It's very nice. You're at plant height, though, so all you see is that view. <laughs> There's a barbecue going on out here as well, so it's a full-on party. So, veggie day, risotto and things. Another amazing summer's day, look at that. Not a cloud anywhere. So, I'm waiting for a nice delivery man to turn up. He 
it hasn't of course it's nearly 10 o'clock and I'm working from home but you can't complain it's really what it's all about in the summer so I'm going to buy something to eat and then he'll turn up whilst I'm out of the house so here we are Olympic torch route Kingsbury lots of people holding phones Yeah, go crazy. <laughs> this is uh, Studio 4A, now nearly finished. You can see Mr. Snaith is still next door broadcasting. This is our new space. It's quite impressive. It's very impressive, in fact. Welcome to another sunny morning in London. See Shard and other important landmarks. The wheel, and the tourists, and the bridge and the water. Anyway, more Olympic torch needs to be done today. Oh, I forgot, and the crazies. Yes, yeah, so I'm off to meet Roberto by the Millennium Bridge to do some more Millennium Torch updates for Hart. So there's all sorts of things going on in the South Bank at the moment. The uh, Inside Out version of the National Theatres, so they're going outside. It's the Festival of the World down there of exhibitions and then round here it's a prop store and lots of outdoor eating and then there's the old good old furniture which was outside the National Theatre last year. It's a lovely day in London and I mean you look at London like this and you think wow that's beautiful and it is. In fact the only thing that lets it down is actually having to go to work here which isn't so much fun but everything else awesome. So the torch has to come across the bridge from the north side. You can see people sitting out on the balconies of those buildings over there. And this comes along the bridge, down the zigzag, and then along the harbour side there. There's quite a few people. Um, not surprisingly. This is the new Blackfriars. It's a bridge and it's really long. But it's quite shiny and new. And you can get to St Pancras and then leave the country as quickly as possible. Just near Sloane Square now. It's my burger. Yeah. Hard social with burgers and beer. VB, it's your piggy. Right here, yours is there. Eat it. Hey, I haven't tried it yet. So then, it's a Friday night. Tubes have gone a little bit crap, so I've had to walk from Mort Lake, and uh, I'm exhausted. It's been an absolutely knackering week, and to top it off, I haven't actually done last week's vlog yet, despite the fact it's Friday. So that's what my evening will involve. Anyway, do watch that one before you watch this one. Good day.